going after the Stardust, then, are you? Which one of these two lucky souls is going with you? Otto, you're with me. All right, then. Where do we find this Stardust, and how will we know it when we see it? There's a river that runs through the southern reaches of the Velcroy. It's the black sand that washes up on its banks that you're after. And I'm guessing you'll be needing sag loads of the stuff. Might be worth our importers at the Dali Milin. I'll head down there. See about finding us a wagon. All right. I'll meet you by the river. You two take care, eh? I'll go and see the supplier. Just don't let that bastard fleece you, eh? Ah, he wouldn't do that. He's Blackthorn's mate. Isn't he? Best of luck. Don't you worry about me. I can smell a swindle from half the twins away. I'll head down to Dalimil, see about hiring us a wagon. Wait for me by the river. Looks like I found the river. Now, where's Otto? Otto. Sorry I'm late. Oh, Clive. I had a quick scout about, and I reckon this area is our best bet. Seems Blackthorn's the only one who thinks smithing with his stardust stuff's a good idea. It's just lying here, waiting for any old fool to fill his boots. But unlike any old fool, you thought to bring a wagon. Well spotted. Now get filling. There's plenty of the stuff about. Might as well grab all we can. That should be enough for now. Let's see how Otto's getting on. How much did you get? Enough. I hope. More than me. <laughs> uh, put it all together and I can't see Blackthorn complaining. Much. Here, Clyde. Do you fancy a walk? Sid would be proud. Of what? Of you, you idiot. The way you've carried on what he started. When we first met, I had you down as a spoiled little puppy who enjoyed nothing more than biting the hand that fed you. But five years on, you're the one doing the feeding. So thanks for proving me wrong. You weren't wrong. But I changed. Thanks to Sid. And thanks to you. When I suggested taking on his name, you were the first to back me. And if you hadn't, no one else would have. I couldn't have done any of this without you, Otto. The old give over. You're making me blush. All I did was choose hope over despair. I gave you a chance. Yes. But you're the one who took it. You took a rabble of homeless, hopeless outcasts and put them back on their feet. Gave them something worth fighting for, just like the old Sid did. About time I was heading back, I reckon. All this scrabbling about in the sand's taken its toll on the old pins. I'll see you back at the hideaway, then. You can take a well-earned rest when you get there. Oh, I plan to. Believe you me. But I'll make sure Blackthorn gets his precious black sand before I put my feet up. He'll only moan otherwise. How'd you lot get on? I brought back all that stuff Blackthorn asked for. There you are. Blackthorn's got his precious stardust, in case you were wondering. 
Blackthorn. Got everything you need. Yeah. Yeah, I do. Cheers for the Stardust. Should be enough to be getting on with. Nice to get out and about for once. Let's do it again sometime, eh? Gav, you're with me. All right, then. So, uh, where do we find this Stardust stuff? There's a river that runs through the southern reaches of the Velcroy. It's the black sand that washes up on its banks that you're after. Southern reaches of the Velcroy, eh? That's down past Alamil. I'll go and scout the place out. See about hiring us a wagon to bring the stuff back to. All right. I'll meet you by the river. While you're off having a paddle, I'll pick up the rest of this stuff from Blackthorn Supply. Take care. You too, eh? Don't go letting him fleece ya. Fleece me? I'd like to see him try. <laughs> In your own time. Go we'll get us a good price. Is that one you want to worry about? Sounds like this river we're looking for is south of the Dalamil Inn. I'll hire us a wagon and meet you there. Looks like I found the river. Now where's Gav? Sorry to keep you, Gav. Better late than never. I've had a quick scout about, and I reckon round here's our best bet if we want to grab as much of this stardust stuff as we can. Don't know what Blackthorn's planning to do with it, though. I asked over in Dalamil, and they seem to think it was worthless. But if Stardust is what Blackthorn wants, Stardust is what he'll get. There's plenty of this stuff lying about, just begging to be bagged. Then let's get bagging, shall we? We shall. Race ya. Bet you a hundred gil I find more. That should be enough for now. Let's see how Gav's getting on. You finished? How much did you get? Enough. I hope. Oh, you win. That might even be enough for all Blackthorn. Hey, I... Before we go, do you mind if we have a chat? Feels like ages since we had the chance to talk. You know, man to man like. It does, doesn't it? Back when you first took Sid's name, we were talking all the time. Working out what to do in that. <laughs> there was a lot to work out. And there still is. Those shoulders of yours starting to feel the strain. Hardly ever see you around the hideaway nowadays. Always on some errand or other. You can take a day off, you know. Well, says the man who spends most of his time behind enemy lines. Only because you keep sending me there. I know I can count on you, Gav. Likewise. So you keep sending me wherever you need to, and I'll keep going. Safe in the knowledge that I have a home to come back to. Thanks to you. Right, that's enough soppy shite for one day. We'd better get this lot back to Blackthorn before he slings his hammer at someone. You go on ahead. And try to get some rest once you're there. Oh, I plan to. Believe you me. After Blackthorn gets what he needs, of course. All right, Clive. I gave all that stardust to Blackthorn, just like I promised. I got everything Blackthorn asked for. How'd it go over in Dalimil? Blackthorn. Got everything you need. 
Yeah. Yeah, I do. Cheers for the stardust. Should be enough to be getting on with. We should go out on maneuvers together more often. <laughs> <laughs>